I'm here at the Platinum Tools booth with Todd Coda. Uh, Platinum Tools has come out with a new version of the MapMaster. Uh, MapMaster is a, a favorite among a lot of integrators, uh, helping them solve some complex problems in the residential installations they're doing. And the new version does some tricks that the old one uh, didn't do. Why don't you tell us right. a little bit about that? Yeah, great. Uh, yeah, Platinum Tools has just recently introduced the uh, VDB MapMaster 2. And what it does is a triple play tester that will do voice, data, and video. And what's nice about that, it really minimizes the cost and the investment that the installer and integrator has to invest in mm -hmm. getting multiple, uh, you know, single device testers. So this device is a very simple to use. Everything's a one button function to, to operate it. The top three buttons on this device are clearly marked with voice, video, and data. And these are your tester buttons. So what you would do, and I can give a quick uh, example of what it is, so let's just say you've terminated your cables and now you want to verify that they are, have been done correctly. So this is a remote that stores in the bottom of the unit and that can be uh, taken randomly th throughout the building. So to the other end of the cable. So what we did, now this is what actually communicates to the tester. So what we're going to do, very simply, hit the data button, turn it on, and it will automatically start sequencing and, and it verifies that the pins on, the, on an RJ45 are wired correctly on both mm -hmm. sides. So it says pins one through eight, matches pins one through eight, and it gives you a pass icon. So it's a very, uh, gives you a reassurance that you have done everything correctly. If it was wired incorrectly, the, what was out of sequence would be flashing and it would have put up a fail icon. So it's a really good go, no go, go uh, verification tool that you've done everything correctly. So. Phase one of your uh, problem is done. Now you know you've made good terminations. The second thing is, as you have uh, in here in our simulated house here, we have uh, basically what a you would find in bedrooms, conference rooms, and in different environments where you've got your wall plates with uh, keystone jacks, okay? So now what we want to do is to accurately locate these cables if you are going into troubleshoot a situation or you're going into uh, you know, running the cables fresh for the right. first time, you want to label everything properly, not just for yourself, but for your customer to manage. So what we have done is we come up with a very innovative solution to monitor this and, and, and map out your network. So what we do is we have these uh, RJ45 remotes and they're numbered, okay? And they come in packs of uh, 12 with the kit. So you, have, uh, you can do 12 locations at a time randomly throughout the building. And then when you go back to the patch panel where all the your cables are migrated and they go down to the punch down of the patch panel, now we can plug simply plug in uh, to the, the port one and now it will be associated with a remote number. And that will come up on the screen so you know where that ends on the other end. Yeah, so what I'll do is I'll simulate this here. This is remote number seven. And so let's just, for example, say this is through the whole building. Very simple to operate again, one button function. We hit the ID button and it automatically goes into ID mode. And it says that cable is now number seven. So wherever you had the seven remote in the building, conference room or a bedroom or wherever, now you, now you know where it's associated on the patch panel back in your network switch. Very so convenient. Very convenient and a process like this usually takes two people to do because it's the old tone and probe method. So you had to have one guy running the tobe, sending the sounds up the line, and another guy with a probe trying to figure out where the noise is coming from and what cable. This is done very quietly, very efficiently, and it can be done with one person. So now you're trying to control your cost. You don't have two techs on the job, you've got one. So very, very affordable tool. So that we actually are help managing your, uh, your cost with your, uh, your, your construction crew. But one of the... Uh, new distinct features that the VDV MapMaster 2 has that our old one do, did not have is that we actually added length measurements. And this is a very key feature for when you're trying to troubleshoot opens and shorts or just identify the cable lengths of, uh, of the actual network. Mm -hmm. Or we actually have these different adapters here to where you can, uh, with alligator clips, you can actually clip onto open bundles of cable or boxes, you know, that's hidden inside the reels of cable, how much is left in that spool, so okay. you can audit your cables. Oh, that's smart. So what you get there is, you know, do I have enough cable to go out for the job to do it? So, oh, let's check. So they can quickly just use a, 
alligator clips clip onto two bare wires and it'll tell them immediately that they've got 400 feet of cable in that box. Okay, that's enough to do the job, let's go. Giving you the length of the open to the short is really a key feature because when, the, when an installer or an integrator comes in and puts all his cables in the walls, they're bare, they're open, they're just mm -hmm. framed out. So he's got visuals of everything. Well, what happens is the, the finisher comes in, drywallers or, or other guys like that, they come in and they will accidentally, of course, you know, maybe pierce a cable with a screw or a uh -huh. nail or a staple. And so now that happens, that's a frequent problem. So they have to go back in, the, the integrator has to go back in and now troubleshoot and find this problem. So with the added length measurement, that's a big key feature to the installer to help them uh, accurately identify that where those opens and shorts are. If you've got a wire running all over the house, you want to know exactly where the problem is. That's exactly right. Yeah, because you you, you just don't want to start over and rerun all new cables. Uh -huh. you know? And that's typically what they do. So now we've been able to control their investment, let them isolate the problem, and correct it, correctly fix it. So, saves time and saves money. Yeah. So the Map Master itself is actually a product we manufacture in the U.S. So it is a made in USA product. The unit itself has an MSRP of 129. The kit, it's $199. Uh, it's very affordable product. It's the installer's best friend, as they call it. So, because it does everything, you know, from old school technology to just standard analog coax to, you know, now IP-based products. So, it's a very uh, helpful tool for, for the installer and will save them time and money. Great problem solver. Thanks, yeah. Bob.